pass in the game, almost like he had a sixth sense. With three quarters behind us, let's see what this fourth period holds in store. On the perimeter, it's Allen and Middleton. Then there's Brooke Lopez. Then there's Drew Holiday. And it's Nora in at the four. That's the five on the floor for the Bucks. And Holiday takes this responsibility seriously. When someone is open on his squad, he gets it to them. Walker. Goes up again. Oh, it's blocked by Lopez. Pass to Middleton. Schroeder with a rebound. Uh, I, I'm trying to think of the last time I saw him miss a shot like that. It's, it's been a while. Here's Toscano. Outside Schroeder. Launches a three. The Lakers with another miss. And the Bucks shooting just around 32% from the field. Allen on the wing. Takes a three. That one falls. Nice feed that time from Holiday. Back-to-back -back threes. Making their defense work on the perimeter a bit. Here's Walker. No luck on that one. And Milwaukee the other way now. Here we go. One-on-one. -on -one. Here's Allen. Another shot. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. That one on Schroeder. You know, one thing you got to love about Drew Holiday is he's a true two-way player in this league. He puts in a lot of work to make a big impact on both sides of the floor. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Things just aren't going their way. He clearly wants to talk it over. Good timeout if you ask me. They have the momentum, and Coach wants to find a way to try and stop it. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. I had a chance to find out what the Lakers coach was going over with his guys. As this game enters its final moments, he told his guys to keep their cool, saying, quote, no sloppy play. Let's stay true to what we do best. We're almost there, gentlemen. And Allie, thanks. And Davis with the block. Out of bounds, it'll be Lakers ball. And the fans love seeing incredible moments on defense like that block. Oh, my, oh, my. And that was textbook defense. Positioning himself well to send it back. Beverly against Holiday. Oh, it's blocked by Lopez. Just an effective shot blocker. Lopez using all of that seven feet, and he does a great job of picking his spots. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for Milwaukee. Davis, the pass to James. That LeBron one falls. James. Coming off Davis' feed. Assistant. And the Lakers and lead by two. Pass to Middleton. The offensive rebound. And the shot goes. You wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the glass. And the Lakers shooting at 49% so far in the game. James passes to Walker. And the shot counts. He's fouled. And it's a chance for a three-point play. Second personal foul. Off the line for the Lakers. Free throw. No good for Walker. It hasn't been his best game, but his team is still doing just enough to be up. It's going to be on LeBron James. Second personal foul. That'll be a second foul of the game. Allen, pass to Middleton. Shot clock at six for three. Allen another three for Milwaukee and what's working here each guy is willing to make the next pass the Lakers trail and here's Beverly down low here's Davis lays it up and banks it in Anthony Davis, Davis has got 14 points now in the second half and Davis has added strength over his career really helps him inside Pass to Middleton. And he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. Neither team able to build the lead and sustain it. After six lead changes, it feels like it could come down to one big play. James passes to Davis. And Davis slams it home. Just another dime from LeBron. And this man, every time he drops a dime, I feel like he moves up the leaderboard. 
Middleton outside. Pass to Lopez. Here's Nora. Check by James. It's going to be on LeBron James. That's his third foul so far. Giannis Antetokounmpo has checked in for the Bucks. Third team foul. Here's Nora. Checked by Davis. And here's Allen. Clock at four. From deep three-point range. Oh, nice D from Walker. The shooter thought he had enough space, but the defender was right on Walker. Did a great job closing the gap, making the shooter feel uncomfortable. Milwaukee calls timeout. Failing to find a rhythm offensively. Something that needs to change and change soon. And coach called his timeout to try and reset things on offense. Shake them up a bit so they can hopefully start getting some shots to fall. And now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, Anthony Davis. This has been one of the most dominant performances I've ever seen. What's incredible is he has no off switch, just a tremendous motor. And he's making an impact on every single possession. And look at him. You think it's just another game. He is totally in control of his emotions. James passes to Brown. The shot's good on the assist by James. James has got seven assists in the game. And that's the thing. That's why he's going to be top five all time in assists. LeBron James just drops dimes. On the wing, Holiday. Checked by James. Back to Anadokounmpo. Outside, Holiday. They get it again. Oh, misses the dunk. For Los Angeles, they've gotten six of 12 shots to go here in this fourth quarter. Walker's shot is off. Milwaukee's gone 7 of 15 from distance in this game. Back to Middleton. Holiday passes to Anadokounmpo. Anadokounmpo is double. Now Holiday. Floats one. Pass to Nora. Now here's Holiday. Second shot opportunity, and he hits the jumper. Holiday's got six points in the quarter. Stepping up, big time basket from Drew. I mean, we've seen him excel in big moments before, but wow. Honor to Kumpo against James. Pass to Davis. And here's Middleton. Let's the three fly. Davis with a rebound. And the Lakers call time here. Bobby Portis has checked in for Nora. There's 48 seconds left in the game. To the middle. Here's Davis. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Yeah, and AD doesn't shy away from the moment. He knows he has what it takes to come up big at the line. Second two. And the second of two is good. And that gives him a lead. I'm sure he wanted to hit all his free throws, but at least he gave his team the lead. Honor to Kumpo against James. <laughs> and he sinks it. It's <laughs> great to see guys who don't back down under pressure. He knew what they needed here and was determined to deliver. Lotto Nakupo against James. Outside for Davis. And that's what you call a big-time shot by a big-time player. AD demonstrating just how clutch he really is. Milwaukee calls timeout. They're behind by one. There's 14 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Guys, what do you think? It's always interesting to see what play a coach has saved for a situation like this. If they've got a surefire quick bucket play, uh, let's just say now's the time to use it. Here's Ana de Kumpo. Missed it! And now we've got an intentional foul. Oh, the first of 
two, no good. A heartbreaker. And he misses the second one as well, so 0 for 2 that time. So it's a narrow victory for the Lick. Alley, thank you as always. The end of the game. Well, folks, that's going to do it. Thank you, Clarence.